Senator, I wanted to ask you as someone who's grown up with healthcare, healthcare that's free at the point of use, I, I, I find it so hard to understand why people aren't protesting for universal healthcare. Could you, like, could well, you explain you are, to me why that? I would like you to do me a favor, Duarte. Can you do me a favor? Absolutely. All right. Many people in America, for a variety of reasons, having to do with the power of the healthcare industry here, which makes billions of dollars every year, having yeah. to do with the corporate media, they do not know how the healthcare systems in the UK, Australia, Canada work. All right, so I'm gonna ask you a question that I hope American viewers, mm -hmm. fans in America, will listen to. When you get sick, yes. or somebody in your family gets sick, or maybe has to go to the hospital, mm -hmm. how much does it cost you to go? It's completely free. It's, it's for, for us Brits, you know, we consider the NHS a right, just like having running water in our house. It's, all right, so in other words, yeah. all right, if God forbid somebody you know ends up with a serious illness mm -hmm. and they're in the hospital for a month, mm -hmm. how much was it cost when they got out of the hospital? It's, it's completely free. All right, did everybody in the United States hear what you said? All right. <laughs> Healthcare in the UK has been since the late 1940s considered to be a human right, not a privilege. Yeah. And do I, if you get fired from your job or in the pandemic, you lose your job. Do you lose access to healthcare in the UK? No, not at all, which is also one of the things which I, I think, you know, it's, it's so sad, the fact that during the pandemic, people have lost so many jobs, but then it's completely unfathomable, the fact that you also lose your health care. I, I, couldn't, I couldn't imagine, you know, that being an extra stress on top of everything right. that's going on. To your American fans who are watching mm -hmm. this, mm -hmm. I want you all to hear very carefully what Duha has said. And it's true in the UK, it's true in Canada, it's true virtually throughout Europe, Australia, New Zealand. Mm -hmm. When people get sick, they go to the doctor they want. When they're in the hospital, they go to the hospital they want. They don't have to pay out of pocket because it is publicly funded. Yes. It's not yeah. free, it is publicly funded, often in a progressive way. Yeah. And that is exactly what we are fighting for here in the United States. We call it Medicare for all, similar to what our Canadian neighbors have. 